Sean Porter through catching up. Uh, man, you know very well Manny Pacquiao. I've been in the ring with him several times. He's gonna face Chris Algieri uh, November 22nd. How's that fight gonna happen? How's it gonna be a good fight, man. I think, it, I think a lot of people are counting Chris out and they shouldn't count him out. I think um, he's gonna get in the ring and, and show uh, his good boxing skills that we saw against Provider Call. Um, and I think Manny's gonna do his all, do what he always does. He's gonna be quick, he's gonna be powerful. And uh, I think he's going to use that southpaw to his, to his advantage. I think uh, Manny will win the fight. I think it's going to be a decision. Um, I don't see Chris Algeri getting knocked out. A lot of people think it's going to be an early night. I don't, um, but I wouldn't be surprised if it is. You know, there's people that are saying Chris Algeri not give him too much of a chance. They favor Pacquiao really big. If you're around Algeri and his camp, you, would, you wouldn't think the odds were against him. He's full of confidence. They're super confident. So do you feel it's maybe false confidence or what do you feel? No, I don't. And, and it goes back to, you know, me fighting Devin. A lot of people think I thought I wasn't ready for that fight. Hadn't really heard of me. They say he's in the same position. All he has to do, he has a, a big opportunity. He has to go in there and step up to the plate. Um, I think Chris has what it takes to step up to the plate. Um, does he have all it takes to beat Manny? I don't know. Okay, um, as far as the, the Pacquiao who fought Tim Bradley in the rematch, how do you feel he looked? I thought he looked good. I thought he looked very good. Uh, I thought he did better than he did in the first fight. I thought he made this fight, the fight against Bradley, uh, the second one, more decisive than the first. Um, I thought he dominated the first, but the way he came in the, in the second fight and just wiped him out of the ring was just, it was it was very good to see, and to see Manny do it in that fashion was great. All right, the fact that um, Chris Algieri was knocked down twice by Ruslan Provodnikov and got up and won, should that give hope to Algieri's supporters because he can get up, or hope to Pacquiao's supporters that Algieri can be knocked down? Uh, both, both. Obviously, uh, you know, you look at Provodnikov, um, for, uh, Manny's, uh, a few steps ahead of Provodnikov. Provodnikov was able to touch Chris, therefore, mathematically, style make fights, we, we feel that Manny's gonna be able to touch Chris even better than Provodnikov and possibly drop him and stop him. On the other hand, you do have Chris. Chris is, um, he's very experienced, even though people haven't seen him very much. He's very confident, and he should be because he is experienced. Um, and like I said, people just haven't seen that. Um, his confidence in being able to box and also his confidence in being able to take a punch or recover or get up and keep fighting as fighters should do, he has everything that it takes to be in the ring uh, against Manny.